right, boys, in today's video, we are uh, going to be checking out the Chef TV Man. As you can see, we got him right here. Oh, oh 1K exists. Well, when, when I was about to record, I saw that 999 exists, but somebody just got a Chef TV Man. That's pretty cool. But yeah, when you uh, first place him down, his stats are like 500 damage, 2 sudden cooldown, 250 DPS, and 10 range, which is a little bit bad just because of the cooldown. You know, damage... Is great, range is eh, but cooldown is stopping it from the first level. Then, at max level, as you can see, has 8,000 damage, a 0.5 cooldown, which is like four times less. If you uh, can't tell already. 16k DPS and four range, so yeah, he's going to get like a 30 range increase, like 7.5k damage increase, four times his bear cooldown, and a lot more DPS, but... I do have some other units, you know, I got the farm scientist, and I got these two for a backup, the TV and the corrupt. But yeah, I'm just going to go into an HQ here, so you can see the circles, and I'll probably, I'll probably go in like a, I'll probably do hard, you know, and so, and uh, I'll try and all skip the most that I can, you know. So I'll be playing hard while auto-skipping the most I can, you know, test out the power of this Chef TV. I've only played a few matches with him. I've only got him to max once, and all I can say he's pretty OP. And uh, he has two abilities, and I think when I first place him down, you'll probably notice it. But, yeah, we just gotta wait here. I'll probably put down a uh, Scientist TV man first, just so uh, we can actually gain some income by killing these toy lots. Yeah, because I'd have to, have to uh, go the way of free to actually piss him down. That isn't the best. All right, he's going here. Gonna skip right there. Uh-oh. He's gonna have to upgrade his barrier soon, but... Yeah, after this, I'll be uh, able to place down the Chef Man. As you can see, he has, like, a stand. He has, like, two doughs in his hand, from what you can see. He, he's got, like, a barrel with probably sauce when you upgrade him. But, yeah, he has, like, all toppings, you know, like, uh, dough, cheese, pepperoni. He got the toppings. But I'm gonna skip here. I'm gonna place him like right there. Okay, he's uh, he's not he's not doing anything. Uh, maybe I have to upgrade him. Maybe who knows? Well, uh, this isn't this isn't really going as planned. It's supposed to attack. I mean, obviously. I don't know why he isn't, but I probably have to upgrade him before he would attack on level one. I don't know if I have to upgrade him. I've never have to uh, done that for him to work, but. No, it's still worth a shot. Because he's literally not doing anything. He's not even from his dough. Alright, I should be able to upgrade the scientist TV man here. If I auto-skip to get 400 money, I would probably be dead. So upgrading the scientist TV is probably the only way that I can uh, get enough money to actually upgrade him. <clears throat> Dual claws coming. I'll probably skip when it gets like right there. Okay, yeah, skip. We only need 200 more dollars till I can uh, upgrade this boy. Hopefully, hopefully then he'll attack. I have no clue why he isn't, but maybe he's sleeping or something on a coffee break. But yeah, he just wasn't attacking at first, so I'll try and upgrade him. You know, my my uh, base HP isn't looking too uh, too sturdy right here. Yeah, we're. It's only at 30 HP. If if any spire toilet gets by or like free normal toilets, that's uh we're, we are gonna be dead then. All right, I can almost upgrade him. All right, let's upgrade him. Hopefully, hopefully you can upgrade now. I mean attack now. I don't know why I wasn't at level one. Maybe they like made a bug or maybe they actually did that. Okay. Yeah, he's, he's not even shooting. I don't understand this. Why is this man doing that? All right, well, I'll I'll uh, I'll try and get him, you know, to maybe like level four, see if he attacks then. I don't know if he's bugged or something, you know. I'll probably try and meet him so I can actually try and upgrade him, but he's just not attacking. All right, boys, I am uh, I'm going to place down my chef. I'm going to try and upgrade him to level three. I did get my scientist up, so... I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and upgrade him, cause right now he's being kind of lazy, and I do not like that, you know. Oh, hopefully, hopefully he can start attacking now, because unfortunately, 
If he doesn't, that would, that would just suck. All right. Oh, finally. We finally got him to attack. Let's go. Yeah, look at him. His AoE is insane. His AoE can kill a 1,000 HP Taurus. Now, the funny thing about this, and I was going to talk about his abilities like midway through, but... You know, you know how the uh, DPS is 8,000? Well, that also goes for the AoE. So basically, it's 8,000 and a 0.5 cooldown, which is 16k DPS. But that's for a normal attack. And then the AoE also has that same damage, because the AoE actually does the same amount of damage as he does, you know? It just got a large toilet. So you, you know like other methods, like the upgrade time speaker man? His AoE doesn't do as much damage as his uh, actual attack but this guy his aoe does the same amount of damage as this so his aoe is doing 3100 alone and he already killed a large toy from the aoe so i have proof yeah he, he's just chilling though i might oh i thought i thought i could sell a tv scientist but i was wrong yeah, he's just going he can reach right here and we, we don't even need all skip he's just going Let's upgrade him to level 5 there. Yeah, look at him. He's killing everything. This is way too easy, honestly. It shredded a minigun. And uh, if you can already tell, that minigun was uh, was being slowed. So we already have insane AoE. And now this guy can slow. Yeah, look. It's being slowed. That is so much slow. Look at the boss. Look at the vet, dude, the vacuum moves so fast, but when the chef comes, it's literally like, just like walking. And the boss is moving at like one mile per hour, so this guy slows a lot. He does insane AoE, insane damage, and uh, level 5, he already got 30,000 range. I can, uh, I can almost upgrade him again. His max level, unfortunately, isn't 7, but it is uh, 6 here, because... You can see that gets 3,750 more damage, which means it will be 8k, and the cooldown will go 0.5. Yeah, look at the boss. The boss is getting shred. All right, look at that. He's just throwing. He's literally away on. I'm going to send him to last. Scientist TV can deal with that. Yeah, we, we, we can just make these boys kill anything. Not even the final boss could probably get past this max one. Yeah, he does a lot of DPS. Not just because of his main attack, but his AoE is a big part in it. Yeah, look at him. He's just going, on. all right. I'm, g I'm going to keep on uh, upgrading these farms here. Just keep on going. All right, I'm going to max out these farms here. Going to try and get as many chefs as I can. You know, just get them and pile them. As you can see, the vacuums, they don't stand a chance. Now, the thing about Chef is he used to be able to attack at literally level 1, but now he can only attack at level 3. That's why I can't do hard all those times. Yeah, that's pretty unfortunate. That is a major nerf, you know? Like, you have to upgrade him with, like, $3,000 until he can actually start helping you. That's honestly a traitor. It steals your money, but, you know, his damage is pretty good, so I, I guess it's kind of fair, honestly. At level 3... It basically does the same damage as a level 1 Corrupt. That's, that's like, that's very similar, honestly. Bosses are getting shred, though, in, like, three shots. We got our second max one. And the thing I like about this is you can literally get a stand on the track. So, Torts can literally stop by for a pizza and then, like, re recap on their journey to our base. All right, there we go. We almost got our third one, yeah. Like, these two combined are probably 64,000, but when I get this, it'll almost be 100k DPS just with these free units. Notice, it is very costly, but it can slow. It does like 8,000 damage for AoE, and each one does about 32,000 DPS. Look, they're just lobbing pizzas. Are you guys seeing this? They're just going. Wait, I, I noticed that like some has dough, some does not. So they're from like, yeah, look, they're getting, they're getting like different pizzas. They had like green stuff, that pepperoni, that no dough at all. Yeah, so this is actually very uh, in detail, you know, they throw different pizzas. And now 
Probably the best thing about this is that it slows. Like, you saw that vacuum? It, it got slowed so much. It got slowed by at least 50%. In my opinion, it probably got slowed by like 70, because he goes probably as fast as like two bosses combined, but now he was literally... Yeah, look at that. It, it, it got dead in like seconds. The, this chef guy is insane. I, I would just say that. Like, it can literally slow, do 16,000 damage in AoE. 16,000 damage, which is if it's a main attack. So one of these dudes is probably worth, like, a godly or spire TV and a lot of ads because, you know, only 1,000 exist. I don't know, like, how long they're going to be out, but... It may be out for a little while, who knows? Yeah, so this guy, he's worth a lot, and if you get three of these down, it's literally almost, like, 100k DPS. Like, two of these guys is, same on, is the same amount of DPS as a godlet. Because if you didn't know, uh, last stream, somebody actually showed me a godlet, and I had 71,000 DPS, so... If you get the chef, man, uh, two of these is basically one godlet, which is uh, probably cheaper. So this guy, he's insane, you know. But that's going to be the end of today's video. I uh, showcased this chef. That's pretty cool, you know. I don't know why the godly is shrinked down so much. He's a literal titan. I don't know why he's literally the same high as, like, the chef man. That's uh, kind of weird. Unless he actually is that size, which is kind of goofy for a little titan. Yeah, the the chef does have attention to detail when, when I throw in, like, different pizzas, you know, different toppings. It's, it's amazing. 10 out of 10, I'll just say that. But that's gonna be the end of today's video. See ya!